Okay. All right, here's the O2 sensor test. I'm testing this O2 sensor. You may recall I was complaining about this connector being hard to get off. Well, I must have said the magic words or been polite or something because I just pressed this like they say to do and then wiggled and out it came. Very easy. All I'm doing is testing the resistance of this O2 sensor's heating circuit. The two black wires, which I don't know if you can see them. There they are. The two black wires are the heater circuit. One's a hot, the other one's a continuous ground. So, I am seeing if this works. And it doesn't. It doesn't show continuity. I'm going to touch this. Well, first of all, I'll touch this to show you that the meter works. But when I touch this other thing, like I'm doing right now, I'm showing infinite resistance. Showing the one. So, there's no continuity there. That tells me that the heater circuit's bad, which tells me that this O2 sensor's bad. So I guess I'll order one. I took some of these off in the junkyard, and it was surprisingly easy. I put my little uh, offset socket on it and went <coughs> and off it came. Hopefully this will be as easy for mine. That'll be something once I order a O2 sensor.